may have seen or used a pedestal fan and you might have it in your own home as well. But have you ever wondered how its oscillation mechanism works? If your answer is no, then this video is for you. Today we're gonna dismantle a pedestal fan and see how the oscillation works. The oscillation starts or stops by pushing down or pulling up this lever at the top. To know more, let's dismantle this. Before we start dismantling, let's just unplug the power supply to avoid the risk of electric shocks. This casing has no screws and just has a press lock. I'm gonna remove the casing just with a kitchen knife. I figured out that the lever at the top is interfering with my work, so first we gotta remove that. And to do that, we gotta remove a screw. And there we go. Now we have removed the casing and we can see the mechanism. Here, the shaft of the motor is extended a little backwards and is attached to the lever at the top that connects or disconnects the shaft to power up or break down the oscillation mechanism. You can see a metal strip down here and its one end is attached to the fan body and the other one gets connected with the motor when the oscillation is turned on. Let's throw this back up so that we can see it working. And we have to be very careful and make sure not to touch any of these metals to avoid chances of being shocked. Ok now it's throw it up and this is how it works. When the lever at the top is pushed down, the motor shaft is connected to the plastic shaft over here and starts rotating. And the strip seems to be moving with a circular and a linear motion as one of its ends is connected to the fan body. The fan head is also mainly rotatable, that is, the head is attached to the leg in such a way that it can rotate. So this is how the oscillation works, hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, don't forget to give this a thumbs up and subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching and let me see you in my next video. Until then, bye bye